Welcome back guys, today we will be continuing graph theory So today we will be continuing incidence matrix for a disconnected graph So let us start Let G be a disconnected graph Having two components G1 and G2 so Then the incidence matrix of G graph is given as I of G that will be equals to a matrix of I G1 0 0 and I G2 so this is pretty simple now let us see an example so we can clarify us also better so I'm drawing any graph any two graphs so let us start from here V1 V2, V3 Here it is E2, E1 E3, E4 And this should be V4 And V5 So this should be E5 and E6 So let us make the incidence matrix of this graph I, G1 So V1, V2 and V3 here it will be E1, E2, E3, E4 So let me write here V1 to E1 is 1 E2 is 1 E3 is 0 E4 is also 0 V2 0 1 1 1 This will be 1 This will be 0 This will be 1 and 1 Now for this I G2 This will be V1 Sorry V4 and V5, this will be E5 and E6 So for this, we have to recall it that the self loop should be 1, this will be 2 So V4 to E5 is 1 E6 is 2 So and V5 to E4 is 1 E6 is 0 so now we'll just combine all of them in one so this will be V1, V2, V3, V4, V5 and this will be E1, E2, E3, E4, E5 and E6 so 1, 1, 0, 0 0 1 1 1 this will be 1 0 1 1 sorry this was for V3 here it should be V4 and here it should be V5 and this will be this will be 1 2 1 0 and the rest all will be 0 So this was incidence matrix for a disconnected graph. Thanks for watching it.